Yo, what is good guys, it is your boy just Jabal and today I want to take you through a couple of things regarding the front squat. I'm going to show you exactly how not to front squat now. As I was front squatting, I didn't actually realise that my form was this bad but as I watched the tape back, analysed it, I can see there were so many flaws in my fault. Okay, we're approaching the first one. The rack off the start is actually very important to get a better start excel as fast as you can that's the first mistake i didn't i made didn't excel fast so the weight felt heavier than all it was then as i'm at the top in this position as the camera comes around you can see my glutes aren't activated and because my glutes are not activated all of that pressure we in our bodies there's a kinetic chain all right so if constant body tension is not maintained then all the weight from that bar is going basically directly onto my lumbar spine or into my lower back so whenever you're in the front rack position make sure to squeeze your glutes as hard as you can okay now from this from this view um some may say it's pretty decent form but when i was watching back i noticed that if we rewind it uh, yeah cool because of let me pause it let me pause it i'll pause it when i get down because i have a flat foot like my feet my right foot is just ridiculously flat for some reason um i've been working it right here right here because it's flat um when i'm coming up my arch the arch in my foot the muscles are not very strong so it's compromising and rolling over when the weight is it's not even a heavy but when i'm trying to front squat it's compromising and rolling over therefore my lower back, as you can see here, caves in a little bit to compensate for my the lower the, the bad arches in my right foot. As you can see, my left foot is fine; it has a good arch, but my right foot arch has just collapsed for some reason. This was about two, three f weeks ago, so um, the arches in my muscles have been improved dramatically since then. I'll show you some clips on my front squat in the weeks to come. Then at the end, I just finished up with some pull-ups. You know, it was fun to get back on the bars. Just want to get that, just the blood flow in my muscles, get my muscles used to working at a relatively high capacity again. So after this, I went straight into narrow, trying to increase my grip strength as well. Went straight into narrow pull-ups. Um, obviously, the reps weren't as high as they used to be, but the strength, more or less, is still there. It's not like I came back and I couldn't do a single pull-up, so that was pretty good. I was pumped. I was excited about that. It was good. First time on dip station since that like, boat. Great. I think I was covering the mic. I'm a cheap joke. Just hold. Just hold. Are they gonna snap? Oh, oh I'm shaking. No pain. It's my G, my mood there, getting the pull ups. He can actually do pull ups now, which is mad. In the next couple of road to recoveries, we'll show you clips of that. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Greatness is contagious, so be great. God bless.